Good morning, uh, good evening, wherever you are, good afternoon. Uh, today is the uh, 9th of June, 2009, and it's uh, 9.06. And welcome to my trading video. And I'll be back with the market open. Alright, markets uh, open up here. And it's a gap up inside day though. Um, so I'll be back with some trades, guys. Well, let's see what I could do. All right, guys, taking a I guess you could call it a scalp scalp long on RTP. I'm in at 191.56, and just looking for a little pop. Uh, could even break through if it breaks through 192 we're, we're flying here this is a one minute time frame five minute uh, that would mean that we're going through highs so uh, this is kind of risky though because going long at, at uh, going long from up here is uh, it's pretty much buying that at the highs but we also we have the stochastics in our favor, and uh, let's see if um, let's see if I can uh, get a good scalp out of this. All right, looks like it might break break 192 right here. Got some sellers. It's having it's having difficulty there, but uh, I think it's gonna go. If not on, oh, there, all right, there we go. I right, should get a nice little move here. I don't want to see it go down too far if it sells off. Still got one minute left on this candle. Not too much volume going through, but it's still enough uh, for what I want to do here, which is just to scalp it. Alright, there we go. Thirty seconds left on the candle. So back on a one minute time frame. I right, like this that it broke uh, 50 so uh, if it goes under 50 I'm getting out of here if I see it go under 50 on the ask I'm gone you know what gonna take it here might be a little too early but whatever oh you see under 50 sells off a bit so made 362 on that play uh, close that at Mostly at 192.47. <clears throat> TXN just got a thousand shares, and let's see if this thing could go to lows here. The market looks like it's it's uh, popping right here, so gotta be a bit careful. Only on the second candle on the time five minute time frame, so like I said, gotta be careful. The reason I got this. <clears throat> Excuse me on my watch list because uh, I see it was I saw it was up uh, seven percent this morning and um, I was looking to short it uh, just just for the fact that it was up so much. I right, just got a big green bar, shorted more, maxed out my buying power, I got four thousand shares, so I'm s just still in scalp mode. So I got a lot of shares. I should get a decent profit well, if this thing uh, goes back towards lows. Which it, all right, guys, just covered out on this uh, on this play. Had a little over four thousand shares. Got some hundred hundred share blocks. Uh, a little bit higher. This thing got scary, as you could see. Uh, in the top five minute time frame. Rode through all this. So just started coming back down, and I'm up 
796. So that was a good profit there, about 400. And I'll be back with something else. All right, just taking a short here on Walmart. Um, it's mostly mostly might just be a little scalp play. And we're gonna gonna try to max it out here. I got fifteen hundred shares. It's not bad. I got sixty dollars out of it so far here. Let's see if I could cover it. Seventy-two. Ain't looking too good here. This is a uh, pretty much a channel channel trade. I'm gonna try to to buy back at the bottom of the channel, which is actually uh, on this candle it's 71, so uh, one cent above that, uh, you probably get lucky and get hit on this. Uh, so I'll be back to update this one. I right, just got 400 more shares and gonna cover those at uh, 5073. I think I got most of them at uh, at uh, 5080. Well, so we'll, we'll see what happens here. I think that it does have a chance to get back to the bottom of the of the channel. The market's selling off a little here, but got to be careful. 10 o'clock is coming in. So that's when stuff happens. Alright, just got a hit on those, so uh took a profit. I'm up uh nine twenty one and uh about a two hundred dollar gain there. Or a little less than that. Anyway, it's uh it's about to hit ten o'clock like I said, so on the economic calendar what happens at ten o'clock? Uh got wholesale inventory, so Let's see how the market's going to react to that. And all right, looks like looks like the inventories are good, so I'm going to take a little long here on Walmart. Let's just hope it breaks out of this channel. If anything, I may get stuck in this. I'm not really sure what the news <clears throat> what the news was, but I saw an up move um, on the spiders. So I'm thinking the news was good, but looks like the traders aren't liking liking it too much here. So and I may get stuck in this trade. Uh, I'll just buy more at the bottom of the channel and just try to trade as a channel trade again um, so be back to update this one I right, so sold out of the Walmart I uh, think it made 10 bucks looks like I made two dollars <laughs> um, yeah so still up uh, nine, uh, 923 and I'll be back with something else. Looks like uh, looks like that news was negative and market's selling off. So I might just uh, what you call sit on sit on your hands, sit on my hands, and just not do nothing for a little while. See what uh, see what sets up. Uh, see what kind of high percentage uh, trades I could get into. All right, gonna try to bid my way into this nav. Uh, just 500 shares, small size. Uh, I should get a hit on it. Uh, it's, it's at uh, 42.06, and uh, probably gonna end up getting more if it gets uh, gets to the moving average. Yeah, this thing uh, kind of missed this move. And, might even just keep going. I might even not even get hit. It's up about two dollars uh, since the market opened. So uh, this is just going to be a scalp. I I still think it may 
it may stay negative for the day so that's why I'm just gonna bid in small size and uh, take it from there it's 500 shares maybe make a hundred bucks on it so maybe I'll be back with something else probably won't even get a hit on this